We back. Are we though? Okay, hold on a second. <laughs> we had a good um, thing running though. Slowly. I know we did. We were building nicely back up. Right. Right. Listen, yeah. Before we kick off, address the elephant. We'll address the elephant. Anton and I have had a chat, and he says that he's ready to make a commitment to the podcast. Oh. Okay. Well, I see that coming still. Now, I want that to be the case. Okay. I think that's what this originally was and should be. Mm-hmm. But, you know, obviously, I am skeptical as to whether he can be consistent and hold his word mm-hmm. to that. However, I up from on my part, I vote that that's cool. Mm-hmm. And we go again. Right? Yeah. And I'll just hand that over to you two. Say something, though. Because well, I know that there will be something that you have to say. Yeah, because we was just discussing. Obviously... Like C just said, we started up, we started back up the pod and we had a nice spring little run and we done three to four pods, getting back into it, putting our feet in the water. And I feel like it was running nicely, do you know what I'm saying? We had an idea of bringing on guests. As CJ just explained to me just now, it makes sense. Having a guest on with four members might sound a bit like too much. But I don't know. What do you lot think though? All right. I love it. So PR trained. <laughs> no, it is my thing, yeah. Um, the reality is... We started back, what, four or five weeks ago. I feel like we've been growing episode by episode. We've been getting better. The three of us, we had to adapt to it. I think the viewers and the fans, initially, they were a bit like, oh, bro, where's tracks? Where's tracks? Something's not quite right. But I feel like episode by episode, they've started getting used to the format. And they're like, okay, this can run, this can run. So in my opinion, I'm like, the exciting thing is that with three of us and starting to get guests, this could have been a very different podcast, but potentially a very exciting podcast. However, Trax is my boy, and this is what's annoying. Like, he's all of our boy. Like, mm. no matter what happens, the fact that he's family. The door's always open. It's not even just the door's open. There isn't really a decision to make. He's, fa- <laughs> he's family. So it's like, in my, in my brain, I'm like, we could have got some big yes as a free, and this could have been mad what tracks is tracks so it's like if it's a decision to make you got to go with loyalty i don't know how four of us can work and have guests i don't know it might work if there's a fifth person there it might work but let's be honest there will be weeks when one of us at least is not readily available that's true to do that's this. true that's mm. true that's true that is um, true i know, agree that, that isn't the point the point is that family is everything mm. but at the same time um you do people wrong and it doesn't matter whether they're family or not. There comes a point where there's like a cutoff point where you've had enough. You know that. So as much as the loyalty is fantastic, uh, that's all, that's great. Number one. Um, I don't want that to actually jeopardize the situation here, the progression that we've made. And you know, you are a good example of how you have let loyalty override common sense. I am not that person, okay? Logic will rule. <laughs> and this is business, not family. It's just, we happen to be a family, okay? Let's not fuck this up, lads. Because the YouTube subscribers, right, are what will feed us, okay? Companies will pay us but they only pay us because people are subscribed to us. So it is of paramount importance that you treat them with respect. Mm. Once you work that out, you can't fuck them around. So if I say, like I've said tonight, I'm doing a video at midnight on the dot, because I've got to get ready, there will be a thousand people minimum waiting. Sure. Right? So... We've built progress with this, lads. The last video is all green on the analytics. Yeah. And, so you, right. and you are right as well. Like us, surely us, obviously, tracks you're my brother, but us, like, switching things up every two weeks yeah, is not going to be consistently it's confusing, man. good for the, for the watcher. Well, right? there's, there's still some, well, there's still certain things that the fans were still trying to get, and they'll, they'll yeah. come in with us. They're like, they weren't initially sure. They're like, oh, but we, we're useful for the people. People want you to be here. They, yeah, do they do want. They do. Right. They do. You know, you said switching things up. Ninety nine point nine percent of the podcast so far that's out in the world mm. is all four of us are on it. So, what do you mean switching things up? 
No, I mean like just in the last few well, months. The, messi- the messaging that we're giving to people yeah, is that like it's free, and then and then so for example, pe- I get a lot of pro- you know I get a lot of private messages. So I get yeah. the last one was like, oh, is it coming back on Spotify? By the way, that's another thing I need to ask you about. Yeah. They're like, well, we want to listen to it on Spotify. Not yet. So there's no. still certain things that we're still trying to yeah. be like, just hold fire, hold fire. So. I guess the good news is that we've only done three or four episodes, so it's not like yeah. we've done twenty and then tracks comes back. We didn't officially ever announce that you weren't coming on. True. Mm. I've True. just said yeah. he's being a dad whenever someone said yeah. anything in the comments, or I've just ignored it. Yeah. And you know, oh, but that is because deep down, not only do we want you to be here, 100%. but also, you know, y- y- you weren't coming, so we got to get on with it mm. because yeah. we have made a decision to commit to doing this. Facts. Facts. And like I did have a conversation with, obviously Reese Reese West, mm. Reese West. Yeah, congratulations yeah. on the award. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. you yeah. know award winning now. Oh, we were recording, aren't we? Yeah. All right, no, go on. Now we're just talking. But <laughs> we're um, Are we? No, <laughs> but yeah, I was yeah. I was with Reese yesterday at an event, and um, he was he, we had a real conversation, you know, about doing the podcast, and I was like, what do you think, like, about just the three of us doing it? He's like, it's sick, man. He likes it. He said it does feel like there's a tiny bit of a dynamic. That, that's missing from it but that might be because mm. he was used to seeing it with tracks you know tracks who winding up cj and then that we all bounce off that he was saying that's to be know? expected though bro. Yeah. like it's that's i've never i've never wound up, wound up CJ, <laughs> <ever>. <laughs> this guy never, but the whole thing but you do you get what i say that it's a it's all it did feel like a different pod like yeah. when me in a good, in a good, in a good way pod, it, it was an, a is a di- it felt like a different pod because you, you were getting away with murder God. that's why no, bro. don't no, do this because, CJ. bro CJ, you, you okay, were getting away with murder bro and i the first thing when i saw the first episode yeah the first episode you three did i literally messaged cj and i was like they've let you get away with murder because he's saying nonsense constantly and i and i literally i I know the points where i would have been like but speaking of getting away with murder right we've all said our bit you've got to say something as well you know tracksuit listen yeah back before he goes, though, <laughs> do you not do you not feel oh, like look, certain look, conversation? Talk, no, talking I need, again. I need to say this. So he's talking over me. He's talking over it. We're back. Yeah. Hey, Trex, he's I talking over me. This. Can I, I speak? All right. You're cool. gonna do this to me for oh, the next six or okay. seven okay. weeks. Yeah. Okay. The CJ feel, show. The CJ show. Do you not feel? Do you not feel like it's been a different pod to the point that we're having grown conversation, grown ass conversation, where it's like you can actually go deep on stuff that you know for a fact. If Trex in a room, he's like. <laughs> he's he's a different world, different planet. Not paying attention, and he's just waiting for a man to, to speak. Slip up. Can I? He's speak? waiting for a man to slip up. But also, then he wants yeah, to go in. You are right. You Siege. can say your part. So but that's also, the only thing I'll say. It's a different pod. Um, it's a different pod. That he no, brings say, enough, that say. side of a dynamic of a human being. It so some on, of the viewers might feel like that as well. So it depends on what like the people that. want. Yeah. Depends but if that's the people, why it works. If the four of us were all different. If the people want shits and giggles, as well as then cool. Then tracks is your like. Let's let's give them shits and giggles. Tracks is back. If people want like. Exactly. Get, but if, 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 the, if the people speak. want listen, elevation, listen. At, no, no. Am I allowed to speak, CJ? I'm, I'm listening, brother. That's crazy. I'm listening. No, listen. I've always supported you guys fully, and we've come a long way, and there've been ups and downs, um, um, and yeah, we've discussed everything that's happened in the past, and I just felt like, like you said, we just want to commit fully, right? Mm-hmm. I just feel like at times, I think all four of us, or definitely us three, have had times where we're not being fully committed. So it's not just me. There have been times where over the whole journey. Me? Yes. I've always been committed, bro. <laughs> do, do your research. I've always been. I've been at every single episode, but I. Literally. No, you haven't. No. Well, no, you haven't. No. I think all four of us at some stage have checked out. Let's be honest. Mm. And, you know, mm. CJ. CJ nearly boxed you in your yard, bro. That's CJ, not, well, no, that, was, up, that wasn't when it went wrong. <laughs> <laughs> the no, the no, moment where CJ was up. backing out was when he was basically in tears on the phone to me. Oh yeah. Right. <laughs> don't people don't for, people, <laughs> people forget. <laughs> no. I bet CJ's forgotten. CJ. When you're talking about was obviously when I had the disagreement track, but I know tracks. I was never gonna back. I was always gonna come back. But you gave me good advice. You said don't. Oh, let, you forgot. Don't oh, that. Oh, that. Yeah. See the drama that we've been through yeah, to keep this shit together. Listen, I'm gonna break this down for you. I'm gonna break this down for you. Very I've simply, right? Been ever present, bro. Very, it's very ever simple. Present. It's I'm very here. simple. I'm here to stay, man. This is our baby, right? Let's not I'm, fuck this up. I'm not going right? anywhere ever. This is for you, at least, a great opportunity for you to get away from your. 
fucking wife and kids. Let's be honest. That's why have he's a here. Break, have a breather. That's See your mates, right? Slightly, See your brothers. Real, that's, right? Reason, your brothers. that's a real reason why he's here. And for bro. the rest of us, it is what we've already said and what we've already committed to. We are just now back in with the fucking class clown. Okay? Let's roll. Shake <laughs> We're back. Let's go again. <laughs> We're back Bro, again. He's he's, the he's agony uncle's back in the building. Jeez. Come on. For the people, they call it. Yeah. <laughs> hey, can we just say as well that tracks who just turned up uninvited? Oh, that's but a very important element. That's, that's a no one brought track. This is not stage. <laughs> this is not this scripted. Is not stage. Yeah, it was, it's I not was like, uh, yeah. this is the part where you pretend that you know you've just shown up yeah but yeah. to be fair i watched Burst. a few of the episodes and i saw the location you were filming at so i oh, run up on man, oh, man. He's telling porky pies what happened was last week he said yo g what are you saying on thursday i'm out and about in london what yeah, are you yeah. saying yeah i said brother respectfully i've got a busy day on thursday he said what about evening evening yeah i said no bro i'm actually out and I'm, I'm, we're most likely to be recording the pod he said pod yeah <laughs> okay he said, <laughs> <laughs> he said <laughs> He said, like, pod, yeah. It was literally accident. Uh, and then, yeah, he stored that information. Otherwise, I would never have known. Yeah, you would never know. Because these men don't even tell me anything. These men don't talk to me. It wasn't okay. for that, Listen, wasn't right? for that conversation. He was like, no idea. See, this is pivotal, right? Add him back to the, add yourself back to the, how do you do the WhatsApp? You Use admin. <laughs> no more leaving WhatsApps. Yeah, I never left WhatsApp. Though. I agree, by the way. <laughs> did I, I leave the WhatsApp? He's a you left so he's many times. This is what I mean. Bro, I leave the you did always it, leave the Did you kick me out? No. Stop it. He's, what are oh, you talking? You leave voluntarily every single time like a bitch. Right, listen, we're going to kick leave things off today. Talking right? of bitches. Because we got... <laughs> are we going out? We've got a lot to get through. How have you been? I've been very well, bro. Um, obviously, this has been a shot to the system, but you know, I feel very conflicted. You know, I feel great, but I also feel confused. Yeah. But other than that, <laughs> is he trustworthy? Is that what's going through? No, head? he's not. He's, he's not. not. You know what? I would, no. Don't. You know what? I, don't. <laughs> I would know. Here's what God. I will say. I will say one thing about Tracy. Yeah? He's a dickhead. He's um. <laughs> is that the one about, thing? No, the one thing about it is a dickhead. He's 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 usually a liability, but I think when he actually does commit to something. He will be back now. That's yeah. one thing I'll give him credit for. Now he's said he's back, he will be back. And that's because he knows we'll hold him. That's good. We'll hold him accountable. That's good to know. So he's not like that guy that's going to be like, Listen, mate, I don't listen, fancy it anymore. Never mind us holding you accountable. Yeah. Now that we have had this conversation, now that you have committed, it will be the people that will be judging you mm -hmm. if you back mm -hmm. out. Okay? Because mm -hmm. whatever happens, right. we're all going to be turning up and doing this. I'm the mm -hmm. most committed here. Mm -hmm. But yeah, aside from that, everything's good, bro. Um, yeah, man, elevation, life's getting expensive. I said to the lads the other day, I feel like my lifestyle is becoming really expensive and I'm not covering it with enough revenue. So oh. I need to start making what? big decisions, man. <laughs> I'm, okay, I'm, I hear that, sp though. I'm spending more than I'm making. making right. That's not good. And right. I don't want to end it. up, I don't want to go out like Wes Brown. Do you know what I mean? I don't Here's know if Wes you Brown. <laughs> yeah, do you know Wes Brown what's filed what's for Wes bankruptcy Brown? recently. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not Brown? funny, actually. <laughs> Wes Nelson. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's sort of Wes Nelson's uncle. Yeah, I don't I don't, uh, go, I don't want to go out like Wes Brown, so I need to be very smart. He's, he was on 50k a week at one point. A lot of the footballers, yeah. man, they've missed out on the big, you know, the big, big paydays. What, like, like Saka? If you were playing week. in like the 80s, 90s, or even the early 2000s, compared to now, <sighs> some yeah. of the kids, man, How much is they're multi-millionaires before Saka? they're like 18. What's Saka on? Uh, well, he's, I think he's it's either French. about to sign or he's just signed a 300 grand, they were calling it, what? contract. Do you get it? Yeah. What? Do you understand? I what don't do think he's fully committed to that well, yet. Did you say 300? <laughs> yeah. 300 grand a week. Do you understand? Why? Why? He's 21. <laughs> why? Why <laughs> ask for him 300 grand? Why? What are you talking about? No, no, no. <laughs> do you understand what's going on? Why ask for him 300 grand a week? He starts every game for England. <laughs> he's been to the Euros final, World Cup semi-final. He's on nearly half. Do you think he's worth that? Do you think he's worth that? Do you think he's worth that? 300 grand a week. Do you think he's worth that? No, I don't think any footballer's worth 300 grand a week, but that's not the question. Imagine really. being on nearly He's not even all that, though. He's not that good. He's good, but he's not all that. He doesn't change games. He's all right. games. What are you talking about? He's bro? not all that. He's overrated, oh bro. God. <laughs> <laughs> okay. He's overrated. Oh, we're back. Okay. We're, we're back. back. <laughs> How you we're been, back. though, Hugh? Uh, uh, bearing in mind everything that's going on in the football world. 
Oh, Rye right, went there. No, because yeah. I'm, well. I'm a football fan now. Might as yeah. well. Oh, don't do that. You are looking at some bone. I did think that as well. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, like, you see the icons really on the, on the thing. Um, but yeah, I'm good, bro. I just got back from a little vacay with the missus. FL. Yeah, man. Nice. Florida. Nice. Um, it was nice to just turn off my phone. No work for like two weeks, bro. And it was our birthday, so I spoke. Uh, and I'm hearing what CJ is saying, though, man. Just spending, bro. You see self-employed and you go on vacay as well. It's long, man. I'm missing out on so much work that comes up, like, <laughs> and I'm just like, wait, I just got to be like, I'm out. You get me? But apart from that, I'm good. Award winning now, you know what I'm saying? One award award winning, yeah, picture yeah. inserted. Yeah, yeah. man. Because uh, you know what it is? I never won an award before. Man's been nominated for yeah. Robos, all that. They never given me my flowers, so. Who won it? Come on, who won the Robos again? Oh, Chip won uh, the best newcomer when I was nominated. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And I can't remember who won best male artist. Might have been, I can't remember. Um, but yeah, so to to finally get some flowers was like really appreciated. Big shout out to Reese West as well because he was there with me, and he he lined everything up at the at the university that he goes. So I big up everyone at LCCM University. They gave me the outstanding award. Cheese. You know what it is that. like. Man's put that. in almost twenty years to this game and never been given flowers. Even though like I hear it when I walk down the street and that, but <coughs> I actually get it from like peers and like music people recognize people that's one of the number one music universities in london um but i was talking about those checks yeah. the other day you you get flowers in a different way bro in a different way yeah, yeah. let me give you an example yeah so i was in a pub with tracks and one other boy as well and we were talking we'll talk about dubai and mm. we'll talk about callum wilson and we're like yeah. i can say this but callum wilson straight away we we're all talking having good banter good vibes yeah. and straight away he said to you he was yeah. like i run it i'm not gonna lie to you yeah. bro i grew up like yeah, listen yeah. to your music like you're that guy followed you straight who else would he, he wouldn't say that to you though would he, he didn't say it one in the bar of course he said it to you yeah but he's happy for his no brother. but as in i'm saying to you like that's yeah. flowers Mate, Ka that's callum like... wilson has not stopped scoring since <laughs> bro, well, like, bro, 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 bro what, what happened bro, in dubai bro, bro, a what can i say right cj was more focused on talking about like is rashford better than yeah yeah but my the way i was talking to wilson was like I, I got gas, but I was like, I'm a striker, you're a striker. Like, I was talking like that. I was like, Isaac's taking your place. So what are you going to do about yeah, it? And and I really appreciate his honesty because I didn't know what Callum Wilson was like. He, he and Callum Wilson was like, yeah, he did, I'm did. better than him. Yeah, he he's not that. a striker, he he's not a nine. And I agreed with him. I was like, he I get what you mean, that. he's not a nine. He is a wide player. Yeah. And I was like, but he's starting ahead of you though, I said to him. He's like, yeah, but I'm better than him. He did say And I was like, okay, so what are you going to do when Saudi money comes in in the summer? And they spend a hundred billion. You're out, mate. And he, that's what I said to him to his yeah. face. Yeah, yeah. And he went. Yeah, he was like, Nah, 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 nah. No he chance. He said himself. they won't get a striker better than me. Uh, and they, and he went. And also, I've got another three years left on my contract, or four years. So he's like, I'm, I'm literally staying at Newcastle. The, I was like, I'm not. I, I said to him, I was like, I'm not sure. But you know what? It's going right. to work he's like right, that though, because there's not that many quality number nines out there, like world class mm. number nines. And also, when you look at Isak and you look at Callum Wilson. Unless they get Harry Kane, who's available, they're mm. not. I don't think they're buying a striker. So I don't think Newcastle are buying a striker. So Have Callum you Wilson's seen? Did you see them play Everton? Yeah, the assist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That assist. Well, that's, yeah, that's, it wasn't. A, it wasn't an assist well, though. But do you no. see Callum Wilson's? What? Assist? What do you see? It wasn't an official assist because um, he was kicking it that way and it hit off the defender. It, went that I, way. I, I said so it wasn't his an assist. Oh, okay, it wasn't technically. Okay. His, his All match. I'll say right is in that flash of like brilliance, he looked like the reincarnation of Omri, Omri bro. yeah it I said the same Wilson was very cheeky and afterwards they asked <laughs> him how do you feel about playing with like were you grateful for the assist and Wilson was like he's a fabulous player but look listen he's not a classic number nine like me but he's a fabulous player he literally <laughs> said that I swear to you he literally said yeah. that and I was like right that's cheeky it's like, very like, subtle yeah. very subtle but <laughs> obviously yeah, it's Wilson. a battle to stay at this club who yeah. are gonna pay you know, fortunes to whoever's on their books forever but yeah. now. But in my mind, so I see Wilson scoring these goals, it was it eight, nine goals in April, yeah. and he's coming to me saying, but I run it, yeah, I listened to your music growing up. Do you know what I mean? So I'm like, mm. that's flowers. Did you say the facts though as well? That's flowers, we spent so really hours and hours with them, right? The whole Newcastle yeah. squad, especially Wilson and Lascelles, and me and CJ mainly with Wilson and Lascelles for hours, vibes yeah. in. But when we get home, they only, Wilson only followed one person on Instagram. 
I said that though. Was, yeah. Ironic. Ironic. I said that. I already just came oh. in just to touch I, base. Like you're right. You're cool. Yeah. I already just said you bless you. Yeah? I was, and he didn't yeah. follow CJ. Oh. He didn't follow. He didn't follow tracks. Jamal sells more though. If Jamal sells was on Instagram, he'd follow me. To be fair. Are you I'm sure? Hundred percent. We talk WhatsApp. But anyway. Do you I'm still not, WhatsApp? Yeah. Hundred percent. We talk. Well, recently. Yeah. Yeah. What yeah, have you yeah. said then? Oh, I don't. I'm not, I don't. I don't want to disclose. Well, yeah. Jamal sells. That's my. Oh, you talk. You talk. Yeah. That's my guy. But Callum Wilson. Ironic. You said. Paper Potter's back in jail. <laughs> paper Potter is mad. I'm done. Paper Potter. Paper Potter. <laughs> paper Potter. No, no. <laughs> it's Wait. my guy, man. Man said United Mansion. <laughs> man said United Mansion. I'm done. Harry paper Potter's Potter. Yeah, yeah, Harry yeah. Potter. Oh, Potter. mate. Paper. Yeah, I love yeah, that. I love yeah. that. Paper okay. Potter. Paper Potter. 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 Not my, back in jail, not my guy. <laughs> Free of it. It's more you, man. That's you, man. I am a big fan of Potter Paper. Why? What's happened? I don't know what the charges are. What is it possession like? Possession and oh, um, fraud. Oh my God. I don't know what fraud. possession or but you know, this really fraud. makes me sad, bro. Yeah, but then I read the comments underneath it and it said, most probably caught with a little bit of weed and didn't pay his taxes. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah but also he's been, is he, is he on like, um, what's the word? Remand. Remand. No, is he on probation at the moment? Is that why they just sent him back to jail? Most probably. But this is what makes me sad, bro. Like these, Pop Papers, by the way, one of my favorite rappers right now from the UK. Um, same with Lowski, one of my favorites. Like, it just makes me sad when I see them going to jail when they're in their peak moment. I don't know how long he's gonna be in for. He might come out next month or whatever, but still like, maybe it's not even his fault, I don't know. But when I hear, when I read the headline, I'll see, but baby's baby's back in jail. I'm just like, bro, this is sad, man. Like he's heading in the right direction. He's one of the coldest. He's got an album coming out ne next week. It's like- His album comes out next week. Meant, yeah, it's meant to be, yeah. It's good promo, like it might work, but it just like his life should be freedom. He should be able to tour. He should be able to go to Dubai, do a show, quick pick up a quick six, seventy bags, and you know what I mean. It, this shouldn't be the time for someone to be behind Crazy. bars. Crazy going to jail was a good promo. I mean, yeah. people, we're talking about the album now. Mm. We wouldn't have spoke about it if we went, didn't go. Oh, there. so could it be? Uh, um, does that happen ever? What well, like, if I'm your manager, right? You got your album coming. Yeah. Then I might just say a little go jail thing. Yeah. <laughs> it's really no, gonna work. It could be set up like no we way. could lie and say you go jail quickly for, oh, like, yeah, yeah, for like a oh, month. Yeah, just be off the radar. Oh, yeah, like yeah. I just I was watching an end dubs interview today and there was a clip of end dubs that came out of police um talking to Talisa saying we're gonna arrest you. Da, da, da. Talisa was on an interview today saying, Oh, by the way, we faked that. That was at our video shoot, fake police, fake everything. We put it out two weeks before for a bit of promo. Come on, these artists know what they're no. doing. I didn't know that. Oh. Yeah, bro. bro. But the pot of paper thing, he goes jail consecutively. Do you know what I mean? Which is <laughs> no, 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 no. One thing I was thinking, man, say, no, run, no, run. Like subscription. One thing I was thinking, though, is how, we don't know how long he's waiting for, do we? No. So what if he comes out on album release day? That would be cold, bro. Yeah, yeah. But it's just, it's not even that. My whole thing is, he should be head down, focused. But you know, sometimes it's hard to get away from the roads. I'm not a roadman, so I don't, I don't know what it's like, but. I can understand it's probably hard to get away from it sometimes, you know what I mean? Is that yeah. a, is that Ed Sheeran, a, as won his case. Yeah, I just read that. that. He just won it. Oh, he won it? Yeah, he is was it being sued for apparently plagiarizing Marvin Gaye's... I'm not gonna lie, this is a very important subject matter because I'm like, you, as you men all know, I'm a big Ed Sheeran fan. So... You're a I big Ed like Sheeran fan. I'm a massive Ed Sheeran fan. Have you bought his albums? Yeah, I don't buy albums anymore, bro. I've got Spotify. Oh, and right. I stream them. Yeah, <laughs> don't, you support your, don't you support your favourite artist by purchasing no. In 2003, I stream. <laughs> oh, I stream. Right. But what I'm trying to say is, yeah. Big fan. Thing, big fan. I think, there's, I, think, I think there's a deeper thing here, right? So if you look at the context of the situation, yeah. apparently this is like it's not Marvin Gaye's kids it's, trousers it's, it's, it's like it's his co yeah, it's yeah. Like, well not even that it's apparently the person he co-wrote the song with yeah. Let's Get It On the Townsends I believe they're called mm. it's his grandkids or something mm. kids maybe daughter I can't remember which one it is but they are suing Ed Sheeran and I think slightly if you look at his backlog there's someone else that sued him a few years ago I think this is Who more had? yeah yeah and he also the gayest, the gayest state yeah. Oh, they the gay. <laughs> no, I know what you no, mean. the gay I mean. estate. They've actually sued um, 
uh, Robin Thicke about three yeah, years yeah, ago. They yeah, won they won and that they one, won, yeah. They won, they won, they won that, how yeah. much? 15 mil. Yeah, I saw, yeah. I saw, I saw, I saw. But so you, you know that song sounds similar to Ed Sheeran's, doesn't it? Yeah, I don't think, bro, bro. Do you know what I'm saying? It does, it does. It does, doesn't it? Let's get on and think out loud. It sounds a bit... Have you heard the thing where, have you seen the video where they play it back to back and like merge them together? Bro, but that's a mashup. This is about chords and progression. I'm sorry, get like guys. I don't think this is about, oh yeah, we've. I think they smelt an opportunity here and they've said, Robin Thicke won money or whatever, like we won money yeah. from Robin Thicke, yeah. we can do for the same with Ed Sheeran. I think then we're gonna try and jump on this. So you don't think Ed Sheeran co um, it, co copied that song a bit? Not in the slightest bit. So you think he, he just went in and, not, he just, and he just wrote it no, fresh? I think Ed Sheeran is a genius, he's a genius So CJ, so you think he just wrote the song fresh from his brain? 100% And it bro. just happens to sound a but little bit like. You know the thing that bro. Ed Sheeran does as well, right? He refixes a lot of songs. So yeah. he will start by doing um, what's going on Mm. Or you know he will use the same chord progression yeah. and then he will remix the vocals from another song on top of that. Yeah. And so, to me, it's like as an artist, creatively, there are moments where I will be playing with, you know, yeah. certain harmony or melody or whatever it is that you've heard from another song, but you're doing your own thing as well, and it but, sort of yeah. seeps into what is really yours. I, I, do, I think I that's the same, the same territory. I do uh, the same thing. Like if I'm producing a record. Say like I want a pop record, I'll listen to multiple pop songs. Goes off their tempo, mm. you know. See what chords they're using, and essentially just build around that. Build around it, yeah. yeah. Just I mean, off their inspiration. Kanye West is, I He's think, a, yeah, famous for doing yeah. this. Yeah. When he first started, he just stole the, the <laughs> drum pattern yeah. from a Dr. Dre beat and yeah. then put it in his own thing, and then you change the samples and you're good, good yeah. to go. I literally listened to both, yeah, before I came on because I knew that this topic might come up. I listened to Thinking Out Loud Ed Sheeran and Let's Get On Marvin Gaye and I was like, how similar are they? And obviously there's slight similarities, but I was happy with the differences. I don't think he's ripped it off. I don't think he has. And obviously he won the case. Mm. So I feel like we need to- yeah, I mean, we is, is he ever Ed losing a case though, really, well, he, in uh, his life? Do you know what I mean? Mm. He, he, is, well, he is quite well off Ed Sheeran. Do you think it's just down to the lawyers though? His team is quite serious, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know? But I think this let Ed Sheeran live, man. Like the guy is I mean, a genius, Ed talent. Is living. He's a songwriter. He's, he he's a living. talented Let's songwriter. Be I'll be real. He's I don't living. give a toss about Ed Sheeran yeah, in any you, way. Like I can't lie. Living. Like I'm gonna free it. I don't give a toss about Ed Sheeran. You've never been Ed Sheeran. I know you yeah. lot talk about Ed Sheeran, but Ed well, Sheeran's I mean, whack. I've not listened to any of his it's albums. It's more than Ed Sheeran, though. This isn't it. It's yeah. about copyrighted music. It's about what you are really allowed to do. Or you know the Robin Thicke one. It was. It wasn't serious copyrights. Like the two main copyrights are melody and um oh, yeah. and lyrics yeah but the robin thick one was of feeling so they said feeling. they gave us the same feeling wow. as marvin gay song wow. that really that shouldn't even be wow they're 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 crossing the the line there with blurred it. lines yeah it? blurred lines there yeah, mm. well, they're obviously a... doing the rounds as yeah. well this family are up I was clearly about, like yeah, <laughs> I was about they've clocked like look we've made money from that one this one sounds a bit dodgy let's go for it do you, do you also <laughs> feel like there's there's a publicity thing as well like by people now because now I'm googling let's Marvin get Gaye on Marvin Gaye and then that's going to get more hits on Spotify streams is, yeah more streams does Marvin right. Gaye need more streams bro well, yes he's, yes he's all, all the dead dons need <laughs> dead dons <laughs> 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 the dead dons streams, need love he's no, had you streams you not, for 200 years no, but do you not think no. there's a PR element to it that now <laughs> he doesn't need more PR bro he's Marvin Gaye bro can you name three Marvin Gaye songs please <laughs> let's get it on sexual healing there we are. That was so confident with the first two. <laughs> he said, let's get on, the Queerlin, and then he just looked at CJ. <laughs> Bro, what's the free? <laughs> was that Marvin's <laughs> sexual healing? Oh. Give me one more, see. No, no, oh, it's on you. You got ours. You got ours. Oh, you got ours. Hey, you're the DJ. You're the DJ. Is this DJ Ronnie? You're the DJ. Is this DJ Ronnie? DJ Ronnie. He's failed it too. He's got you there. So DJ Ronnie, in the music game for 20 plus years, can't name three Marvin Gaye songs. I see what he's doing now. I see what he does. I see what he does. You got to call out the Dodds. You got to call out the Dodds. You see it now. He waits. Oh, what fun <laughs> say? <laughs> While we're doing sort of super producers and music, Timberland has done this Instagram that. video where he's going on about like how excited he is about AI and music. Yeah. And the fact that he always dreamed about doing a tune with Biggie. 
now he's fulfilled that dream and the AI Biggie has done his own verse with his own lyrics. Lyrics which do, they feel a bit weird because if anything, just because he's shouting out um, Pop Smoke. Is it? And Nipsey Hustle right. on the oh, track. Yeah. So it sounds a bit mad, mm. but we're blending, you know, reality and whatever now, aren't we? So Yeah, I think that was like a personal one for Tim. Like he's always wanted to work with Biggie, so we made that happen. So how do I make the Drizzy one happen? Well, here we go. This is the thing, because last yeah. week you swore off this and you said, you I'm said never no, doing it. I'm not involved. It's fake. doesn't have the same feeling. Yeah. Now Timberland has shown you this is the way to work with your favourite artists. Which I said, I said. I said. I said. In the post, he adds, uh, Jay's, is it Jay-Z's manager? It's either Jay-Z's manager or Jay-Z's producer, one of his producers. He tags him. He's like, let's make Who it. is super anti-AI. Is he? Yeah. Why, um, why, is he, why does he guru? tag him? Why? Because I guess he wants to start a conversation i think he was just doing it for more for the fun he's not releasing it or anything he was just tagging jay-z why was he tagging jay-z oh jay-z's m guy because he's anti -AI. yeah because he's anti-ai yeah same man i still don't rate it bro even when i heard it it's like it sounds like it's ain't real bro. do you not think that someone like timlin his like level and status endorsing ai this is a turning point because I kind of feel like it is. I think regulation has to come in place though, because like, ironic can make a song with Drake, right? Oh, here we go. And then it's the like- police. Here we go. <laughs> no, but, no, but if he, make, if he, make, if he makes um, a song with Drake, right, and it's bangs, right? Because obviously Ironic's a sick producer, mixes up a wicked beat, puts Drake AI on, and that pops off in the UK, for example. There needs to be regulation because, all right, fine, that bangs, Drake can let go. Maybe he'll say, all right, I'm gonna take all the royalties, yeah? Mm. But then what's, the, how do you stop another 100 people in the UK you can't. doing the same thing? This then? has got the like, same feeling, yeah. right? It gives me the same feeling as mm. the, like when Napster and LimeWire popped off. Mm. And it was like, all the music um, labels, the industry in general was just panicking. Artists thinking, wow, we can't sell our music anymore because people are downloading it for free. Mm. Labels aren't mu making music uh, money and it was about how they adjusted into, like you said, into a sort of, you know, an organized format that where everyone is playing fair with each other. Yeah. But at the beginning, it's fucking piracy, mate. And mm -hmm. to this day, the people are out there, they've yeah. got these boxes, yeah? They'll record and things are already available. Back in the day, it would have been like your pirate bays yeah. or, you I know, Mininovas. Um, some people won't even know what that is, but it was a place basically where you could download anything that was mm. been screened in the last God knows how long or since they started the website. Yeah. Like literally shows from the night before if you were into programs or films or music or whatever it is. Mm. So right apparently, now- my mate said porn as well, apparently. <laughs> Unless your mate said <laughs> 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 um, Right now with this AI thing, YouTube has been taken over. It is flooded everywhere. Put your favorite artist in, put AI in, bang, 500 new tunes come up every day. That's right. mad. Because people are now able to just go, make me that tune with that guy's voice and, you know, within minutes it's doing it. This is, but this is what I feel like is crazy yeah, because I've seen a couple of people talk about the benefits, but also the negatives. Like we spoke about this in the WhatsApp group chat. It was like, we're now entering a scary place where AI now can replicate voices and, I could pretend to be your your son or your relative here, mm. you know, and be like, I need money right now. Can you transfer? Why me? The reality is we we live in a world where there's a lot of greed, corruption and, and fucking evil, right? Mm. So this incredible creation that we have, this AI automation, robots, yeah, 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 fantasy, it's gonna be twisted and there's gonna be a lot of dark, dark yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot things of dark that stuff, are being done stuff. and we've got to be ready for that so i'm like you know if you're online mm. all of us are immediately susceptible to having our voice recorded manipulated oh, in gone. such a way where we're, yeah they can make us say anything who we're done out here you, you are done out here you've posted a million say, videos on youtube let's say for 10 years you're that's done it doesn't matter about bro. me all of you're us done. you only need <laughs> you, you, you only need a few hours done. worth yeah, and you've got yeah, everything yeah. we're all done <laughs> we're toast we're toast but what i will say is yeah um the own what was it like someone who's worked for google for ages who was instrumental in creating the ai oh, do you yeah. remember do you see heard about this he's like he came out i was like i'm really sorry for what i've done he said i said i can't get involved in this anymore he said this is i'm i fear for what's gonna happen over the next few years. So if someone who's been instrumental in the AI movement, who worked for Google, is coming out and publicly saying, I don't know what I've done here. I'm really sorry. 
we're fucked. It's an L. It's an L. Are we just sitting here be like, yay, AI? Yeah, we've huh? done it to ourselves. You say, we yeah, you were saying, like, yay, Mate, AI. You love AI. AI. What you on about? I've never said yay, AI in my life. What are you talking yeah, about? Bro, I said, we love AI. 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 Yay, yay, AI. He wants <laughs> yay, AI. Terms of, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> in terms of opportunity and collaboration, <laughs> yes, of course. Music, yeah, yeah, whatever. You've got Drake with Michael Jackson, whatever. They would not, that's a random result. What I'm saying, in terms of our well being, <laughs> yeah? In terms of our well being. Yay, AI. Yay, AI. Listen, lads, we're toast, man. We're to your missus gets a call next week, Ron. Yeah. yeah, babe, or tonight, babe. Listen, the studio's overrun. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? Yeah, then what? The what? Then what? God, then what? I'm <laughs> Listen, I'm, I'm, I'm out. I literally can't come back until next week. Um, uh, yeah, yeah, but then, but then Ron turns up home at normal time. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> so what? What, what is this example? Yeah, see, let's forget one thing. The internet well, is can... not real life, bro. I just it's... go home. Let's go home, bro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, you yeah. called me early. Said so you're not coming until next week. I'm not coming yeah? until next week. Transferring money. I'm, f I'm screwed. I'm stuck. I mean, yeah. lost a blue tick. Yeah, everyone has, bro. Oh, what? No. LeBron James. LeBron. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Who? LeBron. Who's LeBron? LeBron James. <laughs> oh my god. What? But like Lee. <laughs> LeBron James lost his as well. Is it? Would... <laughs> 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 What's what's a LeBron man? <laughs> what's he on about? <laughs> Everyone's bad. losing their ticks, bro. <laughs> yeah, get me. So LeBron he, James. He's now called LeBron James. So you're just you're just normal man now. Yeah, Everyone's just normal, normal man. I actually I actually preed it today. I went on. Is that good today. though? <laughs> Is that good? <laughs> man, went on Twitter about the tick. Settled in. You know when it settled in today. I followed someone like a big producer in LA. <laughs> mm. You know, usually the blue tick gives you stripes. Man. Yeah, follow yeah. back straight he, away. Elon's yeah. taking the piss. I followed him. I remember those. Yeah. Like, yeah. Elon's, yeah. Taking, Elon, yeah. Elon's taking the piss. Yeah, I was another Don on that timeline. Yeah. You know what's bad? Yeah, the, same, ones. the same things that happen on Instagram. You know man, what they're doing? I, they're, they're balancing out the bro lads. It's you coming. Yours, it's yeah? a great reset. Bro, everybody lost their blue tick. You know, this is all part of the The only thing that's happened, right, is what he's done. Because so many, so few people signed up to get the blue tick back, because you have to now pay whatever it is a month. Yeah. He decided, I think, to save face and to stop big names leaving the website, which is the only reason they're using the app, let's be honest, mm. to give back everybody with a million, follow wow. a million followers and over a back their blue tick for free. Oh, yeah. Oh, so LeBron's got it back. LeBron's got so it back. So anyone's got a million, Beyonce is back. now Beyonce He's again. taking back. a piss. Oh, oh. So now he's we're really oh, so he's fucking really A minute piss. under, he said, La he's taking the piss. Wow. <laughs> so now it's a real He album. is mugging it. He is fucking mugging it. So do you reckon this is going to happen with Instagram? Of course it's going to happen with Instagram. Of course it's happening with Instagram. What I'm being told, right, by someone who, this is whose mad. opinion I trust about this is that he's at least trying to make it about uh, all this verification about security. Mm. So it's about stopping accounts being bots, or at least yeah. that's what they're trying to say. That's how I'm, it's being sold to me. I'm, f I'm yet to be fully convinced, but yes, eventually yeah. the account. idea is that every social media website will be so overrun with bots, which are run by AI, which can actually have oh. con conversations with people to reply and influence things like poli um, you know, elections or whatever, right. are gonna be such an issue that this verification process is almost like necessary for this that website to run properly. That makes sense, that makes more fucking sense. I mm. get that now. See, I now understand why this is a thing now. That needs to be more publicly <coughs> known. I don't think but people get But there that. are problems with that though, because not everyone can afford to pay X amount a month. Then just yeah. let the fucking and verification no, go. No, 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 no. Because what this is, is the beauty of Twitter is it was a place where everyone could go and speak right? yeah. and have their say and find out about news. Yeah. And if you were in the middle of fucking, I don't know, Zimbabwe, mm. you can have as much of a say as someone who's in the middle of, yeah. you know, Zanzibar or Arkansas. But you know what I'm clocking now here is that when I, when I go on Twitter now, man like me, man like you, who have worked our asses off for mm. years doing, you know, dedicate, dedicating time to our craft, we got zero blue ticks, but now you got man them just riling up the net with a blue tick they're that's paying mad. 20 pound a month yeah, for. That's mad. And it looks like it they're, looks pee, they're yeah. looking like the ones with levels yeah. and we ain't done nothing with this. It, I mean, pee. they, they are pee. the ones with levels and what, what the blue tick does is it enables you to 
have full access to all of the features that the website offers and one of those is you'll be prioritizing the replies wow so wow. yes you're gonna have to pay to be seen wow you have to essentially pay, because what do you mean you'll be well look responses. if you practice yeah. by putting out a tweet that mm -hmm. people respond to mm -hmm. you will notice especially if you use the phone or the website yeah. that the people that are put at the top of the responses, the first ones you see, are without fail, oh. always oh, paid, yeah, verified, bro. subscribers. Oh, this is all that. Yeah, or, this is all um, mad, bro. Are what? you going to pay? You might have to soon, you know. Mm, How not, much is it? Not until it's... I mean, look, uh, I probably you will end up doing lot, it bro. if I have to, yeah. right? Yeah. But essentially, I don't really want to. If it becomes like Spotify, where He's actually, thing, to me, yeah. he's killing the website a little bit. 100%. Yeah. Um, the third-party apps were something that really helped it to grow. Twitter didn't even use the fucking bird for till like 2006 or maybe even 2010. Mm. It wasn't even called a tweet because of Twitter. This is all because of third party apps and I people that have built their own that. apps off of the back of the code and helped it to grow. So, you know, I used an app called Echophon, yeah, which was that. really sort this. of clean and yeah. had no ads on. And yeah was in chronological order and just mm. dark mode years before Twitter was had that available. I go onto Twitter now mm. and it's just... It's a shambles. Yeah, it's just a shambles. Place, yeah. In New York, there was a guy on the subway who... Oh, this breaks my heart. He might be homeless. He's definitely got mental health issues. Mm. Um, he's had mental health issues because his mum was... Probably anyway, because his mum was murdered like 16 years ago. Um, and... Anyway, he basically, I think, was distressed at the time. And <laughs> this ex-Marine, like, jumps on him and does this UFC fucking sleeper hold on him, which mm. he keeps on him. And to wow. be honest, there are three people jumping on this guy. But this ex-Marine has <laughs> got the sleeper hold on for, like, three minutes, and basically he's just dead. Do you know what I mean? So, um they then police then i guess there's almost riots or there's definitely protests right now because they questioned the guy and then released him <laughs> so wow. that's caused a little bit of a thing and it's brought up a whole few things in my mind but i'm sure you've seen this I why have they why have they released him um i think because it is manslaughter and not a homicide but I'm not 100% the sure. They will definitely be speaking to him again. Did the guy with mental health issues, did he say anything to taunt him or anything? Or I, think he, was, I think he was saying, you know, how depressed he was and um, how he needed food and, you know. Well, wow. like that man killed him. He He's not old. He's quite young, this guy, I think. Mm. And... There is, I'd say this much as well, there is definitely like a problem in America with their mental health situation. They don't it's, look after it, people at all. It is to a different level. Bro, not even just America, I level. think it's worldwide, bro. Like no, but especially in America, especially in New York. They just don't have no a system paying for healthcare. Everyone's paying for healthcare, sorry. You don't have any, listen, London, UK is not exactly amazing nowadays in terms of rates and wait time and delays, but at least we have the NHS. New York, America, they don't have an NHS. So people who are mentally can I say deranged? Is that PC? Maybe it's the wrong term. Apologies. Mentally but deranged. Can but you, you I mean, I don't know. But you, people who are mentally unwell, mm. you there's not a system where you can go and say, can you help me? So you could just got thousands and thousands of people who unhelped. are unwell, just unhelped and just living on the streets. Mm. Yeah. That's why if you go to York now and you go on the um, subway, you, you're likely to get at least eight or nine different people who are going to mm. jump in front of you and say, ah! <laughs> I mean, maybe ex an exaggeration, but yeah. you know, at I'm the same time, I'm there are a lot of characters, let's say, yeah. who've got <laughs> stories. Well, you you lived in New York, couldn't it? So. And the homeless situation is something it's very, very serious. Huge. It's, it's gone to a different level. Like. It's gone to different mental level. health uh, or the lack of help for people with mental health issues is mm. more evident there than anywhere else in the world I've been. Do you not think mental health is like the least of your worries when you're living on the street? No, it's what? What do you mean? If you're living on the street and sleeping in the bins and stuff, do you not think your mental health is the least of your worries? I'll, I'll be no, more concerned about is warmth your and stuff. Your whole experience of your life is in your head, so uh, your mental health is crucial to everything. Yeah, every but I, you are. But the life. problem, the problem is, I do mm. actually feel like, like genuinely, I feel like everyone's mental health is tested. It's it's an ob obvious thing to say, but everyone's mental health is tested on a daily basis. So I feel like 
even four of us in this room, I feel like some people's capacity to deal with it might mm. be here, some people might be there, there. I feel like the general population, mm. not everyone can deal How's with your it. mental health? My mental health is very good, bro. To yeah, the point where strong my mental, mental health is amazing. To the point that I'm like, and obviously, like I touch wood, but Boss. like, nah, wait, 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 lava. To the point, to the point lava. that I'm like, I get a lot of things. No, no, no. But I've, yeah, no, yeah. Good luck. Not your wood, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what about talking about touching wood, man? <laughs> no, but but to the point that, you know what I mean? Like, there's so many, there's a lot of setbacks and there's a lot of things that happen mm. but you but just you got, seem like you crack on bro a lot. to the point that i'm like no listen i spin it and i laugh i'm like we're just gonna have to use that as an opportunity mm. you know the ones where you have them conversation in your head i swear to you, yeah, you like, have to, bro. i feel like if there were lesser men that go through what i go through situation wise it'd be over mm. but i just flip it and, that, and i'm listen it's not me trying to make a big thing out of it but i'm like i think when you have those moments some people can deal with it in a situation, but everyone has hardship. Everyone, mm. everyone. Um, mm. So yeah, and I think what helps is you've got scenarios like this, camaraderie, vibes, boys, family, and it, it keeps you going. Mm. Um, but there's a lot of people that are not going. That but you're in a, you're, you're, say you're in a good space though, right? You're in a good space. You've got to be grateful for what you have. I've got a house, I've got a yeah. lovely wife, I've got, a, I've got a dog, I've got a family, I've got a yeah. whatever, oh. do you know what I mean? You know what I mean? So these are the when you say good space, getting, what do you, what do you not, mean by good not, space? Yeah, you're not homeless. You're not getting yeah, 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 yeah. Right. healthy. I've got people love me. So I mean, like, I mean, like, do you mean mentally or do yeah, you mean mentally? Outside? As in, like, as in, like, say you know there's ups and downs in life, right? Mm, mm. When going through the downs, do you feel like, well, bro, in my head, I said to myself, I was by the time I turn thirty five, I'll be clear. So when oh, okay. I turned thirty five and I wasn't clear, I started looking at myself. I was like. Yeah, that's you fucked, time bro. pressures. You so, really so I, I literally, you know, since I turned out, I've been very hard on myself. I've been yeah, very much like, be. right now, I'm like, you're not delivered. What's bro. clear, like 10 mil? Very, yeah, maybe. Or maybe, like one mil. One maybe, mil. maybe, 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 maybe. <laughs> so I'm like, so the fact that I haven't got that, I'm already like, you, f you flopped. Then I have to say to myself, no, nah, but it's time to go, it's man. Still time, bro. So you got you got to be able to say, we're right, just getting cool. started, baby. This is it. This is it. You know what I'm saying? But it's it's having those conversations, yeah. though, bro. And that, like I said, like expenditures going up. Um, mm. Do you know what I mean? You but just got to be ready. Then, bro. Like, ready. Uh, expenditures going up, but you're doing up brunch every weekend. Exactly. So you so can't I, complain because man at homeless. Hundred percent. Yeah, because quite because quite simply. That's what you I said to you about my lifestyle. That's what I said to you about my lifestyle. I need, it's on me like if you cared yeah. so much about expenditure you could technically say do you know what for one year yeah. I'm just gonna stay in 100% I know I know and, this and, you know you'd, and you'd be up yeah, I, know, I know bro I know this I know so this. if you know it why don't you do it I don't want to bro you I have all my <laughs> I, I, I have all, I like I have my, all my friends you're most probably I like my you life. or another one I like are life, the top two who are literally out bro, you know all what, you the know time, what, you know any said, moment, you know what I've said to and myself literally, now. like if you don't go out for like a week, do you know what I've said it's to myself a big now? deal to you. you. Know what I said because I got really angry with myself a couple of days ago. I was like, okay, this is the situation. Yeah, you're spending a lot of money, but you, I really like my life. Yeah, I've got, I've got a really bang good girls and that. Yeah. I'm only joking. No, I've got a wife. Only joking. <laughs> I got a wife. Yeah. I got a wife. I was yeah. joking. So I'm like, <laughs> That's so it. I'm like, I'm like, okay, what do I do about this? Yeah, I'm like, what do I do about this? So I, I said, I said, I said, I just have to make more. It's very simple. I need to, I it's need to position myself. Clown. Mate, what are you Sorry. waffling on about? I need to. What are you more. waffling on about? <laughs> what is going on? Are you, uh, you are talking absolute codswallop. Oh, this I guy. said to my friend, <laughs> to, mate, what is going on? Oh uh, yeah, the pause gone. Listen, <laughs> listen, 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 listen. It's all going in. It's all going in. It's all going in. The people are listening. Stay tuned. I said I've got to make more money. It's very simple. <laughs> Why is it? Make more money. Okay, Stop right, complaining. How's that going? Because at the beginning of the pod, you said, "Fucking hell, mate! I'm spending more than I'm making. <laughs> What's going on here?" Bro, we need we need to get the millions in. That's it. It's very simple. We need bro. to get the millions in. Not right. back, not thousands. Yeah. Get the millions in, yeah, right, okay. and then we'll find. Do you have a time right. frame for where you think you'll hit that target? Like where you're like, I don't know anymore, financially bro. Content. I don't know anymore, bro. I don't know anymore. But one thing I do know is that a lot of people have gone clear, and I'm very comfortable. I've said to myself, "Listen, run your own race." 
Some I don't like, understand what you mean by clear because I've been with you a lot in my life and clear, I've been bro. recently some people I've been to Dubai with you for example some people are clear. and you're dropping racks on man's head you're dropping racks no, everywhere be, you're yeah. going out, <laughs> you're going tracks I've got this table it's on me and I'm thinking yeah. there must be clear. other men in the world or other women in the world that think rah I can't do what CJ does but yeah. so you, you, you definitely are dropping racks I everywhere know, bro I hear that I hear that so, so what do you mean gone clear I'm being real like bro goals, I'm being real like, you say gone clear I've got I'm dreams, being real with you I look back at where we've come from to where we are now I you it. are financially doing well in life yeah. so I think I mean? think no but I, you know what I hear that but also don't forget you're only as good as your last performance yeah it's mm. like playing Premier League football you've got to keep it going so now I'm like okay now we've got another three or four weddings next year we've got another yeah. three or four stag do next year do you know what I mean that's already yeah. 50k to come yeah. and then I'm like okay cool I want to be in a position where I'm like this is on me you've got to maintain it mm. 2022 that's last year 2023 that's this you've got to keep going mm. so that's what I'm trying to say so I need to be in a position where I'm not you don't want to ever be like money there or cost there you, you, don't, you, you don't want them you don't want to be tight tight you want to be like you yeah. see it you want to be like there yeah, yeah. and then cost it there. and then you're like cool just yeah, yeah. rain it all down i see that you see where i'm coming from yeah, yeah, okay. so that's all i'm doing I, that's I, all I i'm doing that. i agree with that. you need a buffer you, know you need what? to have a buffer yeah. have right, a buffer where a question, if though. someone says oh yeah lads you want to come out to dubai next in no eight, in, in um july yeah. Yeah. it's gonna cost us spare 15k but yeah. it's calm yeah. and you don't want to be like oh shit, 15k yeah you don't want to be like, oh shit, raw. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? And, I, and, I, and I'm all right. All right, cool. But I want to wanna, be, Basically, yeah. you want to get to a position where you don't even check your bank. 100%. And I'm no. not there yet. Do you lot still check your bank, be honest? You have to. I, yeah, I do. I'll be real. Of course I check do. Check my bro. bank. Of yeah. course I do, bro. Your balance. Well, or do you just type What do you mean bank? check my, like check it for what though? Like, like check how's what? How's the funds doing and that? Yeah, I'll check, yeah, obviously we check every month. I'll check my bank. But it's like, I'm going to check it when I'm like, Buying a sandwich and check my bank. Oh like, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, you got you got to check things, bro, lads. You got you to check to. things. You don't, I don't of, check my bank after lads. every purchase. Uh, yeah, don't you check your bank you after every to. purchase? Uh, I'm ready. Alright, I'm ready. If you're on top of your finance, you got to check your account, bro. You got to check your money, bro. Wait, wait. After every purchase, you're check checking your bank accounts. <laughs> and I'm saying, what, like, oh, what do you mean check your bank? <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, no. So say you've been on a trip and you come back. Do you oh, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll check my bank. Yeah, or after a weekend. No. No? No, not after no. a weekend. Yeah, because nah. when, you, when, no, when, no, you, no. when you go on trips, right, you select an account that you move, you display. Uh, yeah, I was, I was about to say, yeah. I was, I was, get a, I was a section. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Listen, right, it is important as well when you're chasing the dream or chasing these millions that you yeah. say you need, right, to remember that at some stage, you know, enough should be sort of accepted as being enough. There has to be a, a place, I think, where you're like, okay, even if you keep working and keep chasing stuff, that's yeah. fine for like, you know, having a purpose in life, but also a place where psychologically you're comfortable and not getting off, but saying, you know what, let's enjoy what we've done oh, as 100%. well, you know? 100%, yeah. yeah. CJ does that. No, yeah, honestly, yeah, lads, lads, I'm very happy in my current scenario, but I do feel like there's never you're always, you need to keep being progressive because like, like I said, Wes Brown, bankrupt, mm. yeah? Mm. If you live a certain way and you're not being careful about what's coming in, that's why you gotta respect the people that have got different streams of income and different like portfolio models. Mm. I'm like, okay, now this has made me really focus this year to make sure that I've got at least three or four times what I'm spending coming in. Mm. That's what I'm trying to do. Yeah, so awesome. all the people that are clear in terms yeah. of like materials, Rolex, whatever, I'm like, that's cool. I've got two properties. Don't worry about me. But I'm like, I want to make sure I've got money coming in. Are you not happy with where you are financially or in your career? I, I'm very happy, but I feel like I could do more. I'm, I expected millions, bro. I expected millions by now. So what, I financially or in your career in my, though? Because there's I two expected, different things. I expected to be at least worth. Jeez. I expected to be, yeah. I expected to be a multi-millionaire with assets worth over tens of millions. Basically, I've not achieved my That's goals. That's too much pressure, bro. I don't really care. You know, most of That's the biggest moguls in the world have, have never made millions. I don't million, care. That's what, That's, what, I, that's like what I expected. I haven't achieved those goals. So what I've got to do now is I've accept that 
actually it's probably a deficit to mm. the point of what I thought I would have. So all I've got to do now is basically what is actually give it is in like to the point where when I look at minus six, I'm not listen, I'm not gonna talk too much about finance. I'm in a comfortable position, but I'm not where I wanna be. Mm. So now I'm like, let's go, let's get the millions in. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah, and, my, yeah. My, and I think we can do that. I think we can do that. I've got assets, I've got properties, you know what I mean? Mm. But I want Liquid are you happy cash. financially that's what i was gonna say my thing is more like i'm happy super happy with everything i've done in my career and, and like the moves i've made but just financially i wish i would have done smarter moves when i was younger now i'm older i can I, i've made the mistakes so i can try and fix them and do better but i do feel like I, i've achieved everything i've ever set out to do apart from say like have a stable house and you know have millions in the bank like but you saying. can still but what no, and i know that that's what, I'm that's saying. what i never set that pressure on me but that's just all i and that's have realized and that's why i'm okay as well because yeah. i know that we can still have the millions yeah, in the bro, bank. are you looking to buy a house on the missus yeah that's the next step yeah, yeah we're, we're we're getting there yeah. how do you feel the tracks about the whole thing like finances and all that sort well, of i stuff? was always happy when i had zero money yeah. I've never been driven by money. I can't lie to you, man. In any way, but it's a, it's not a good thing. I'm not bragging about. Yeah. I'm not bragging about. It. Like, I, I, I got into, I got involved into money. CJ will know this, but I got involved into money because of my missus. Mm. Mm. She made me a bit more driven because before her, CJ will tell you I was a bum financially, of all, and 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 a very happy bum. Yeah very happy you say, i'm the same though you like you just you don't have it you don't want to chase money no I mean, you want to do things that you love doing enjoy doing S yeah S like, 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 like i always yeah. remember like growing up here yeah, especially with cj he was definitely more money than me and like he wasn't comfortable not having much money mm. but i remember like when we we're rolling around on the streets and stuff or going shoot here and there i'd have like one pound like whatever well, right and uh, buzzing happy but you would never know like whereas in CJ will be like, no, I'm not going out with one pound. Like, we're not going to the rave with one pound. Like, like he, he will, he will, he like try no, and. To be fair, one thing I will say is that I, I've got a great feeling about what will come very soon because this is the first time, maybe in like three, four years, things I've been very scattergun and I've had like my fingers in like four or five different pies. Well, now I'm and women and gyal, <laughs> yeah, yeah, and gyal allegedly certain. Only, only, only joke. Well, now oh, I'm like, only I can, I can see. I can see there's a money goal and I've had some very serious conversation over the last few weeks. I can see what needs to be done mm. to get to a point where it's like the racks on racks are coming and that's it now. So Talking now about fingers and gal, yeah. who fingers gal? It's a, it's a, it's a very that's young thing, thing, isn't it? Like, you know, like, no, 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 fingering. No, no, they don't, the young generation don't do that anymore. Fingering, what no, you think about No, I, like, from podcasts I've heard. So it's not they a base two? No, but you know, no, 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 you deep it though. No, when you're like a teenager. Wait, do you remember so your teenager? Base two. From like podcasts I've heard. Do they still use base? Like, do they still call No, they're going straight to, you know, like scenes in Pornhub, they're pissing on. Lads, you know, lads, you know. Wait, what? Lads, 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 lads. Lads, 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 lads. You know, lads, lads, you know, remember. The only fans and all that, bro. This do, is you do you remember when you were young, yeah? No, no, like young, young days, you yeah? know, like teenage days. Yeah. Fingering was a thing where man would spot That's you what I'm just saying. No, remember I that, wanna, yeah? wanna, this is man. Yeah. Uh, he's saying that, you know, back in the day, you talk to a girl, maybe lip circus, or, do you know what I mean? Base one. And then it's like, from there, you then maybe go to base two. Or when you're young, when you're young. Yeah, but yeah. I remember, do you remember that back- It's that there's an order, and then after touch, then maybe base, you respect the, the code, yeah, the, yeah. The, the, yeah. the hierarchy, do you know what I mean? He's saying, no, you skip all that. Yeah. It's straight to golden showers, man. Huh? No, no, no. I think now it's straight to shines. It is. Yeah, it's straight no, they to skip shines. steps because they're watching. No, you still have one. Bro, they're you watching. One. No, they're watching. No. There's a few no. things, bro. They're that base one. Like, I see. No. There's a few things. Why <laughs> shines? Hey, it's because people have lost uh, their attention span. Wow. And for two, they're watching wow. porn. Wow. But when you watch porn, they're not fingering. So you talk yeah. to a girl. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. you're saying you get you say you go basic without even. They're just doing... slamming straight yeah, in five minutes, bro. Wow, team, that's funny. But do you not, do you not think Matt don't think like, oh, wow, is that childish though? Oh, like, no, you know what, you know what? No, that child, was that childish? childish? No, when you've been back to like when you were in no, raves, you're right, yeah, you're like, and you're not really, yeah, it's not really. But no, but at the same time, it's really. us taking our times, like it's different pleasures. Yeah, you're you right, you're right, you're right. These are going straight into golden shower, piss on face. What I'm saying is, what I'm saying is like, life's mad. Like, say I'm on a single right now. Imagine going out into a club and fingering girl. One thing I will say Man, now, I never did that. One thing I will say now, one thing I will say uh, now, yeah. I think it's very <laughs> now to go base one straight to base four. 
Mm. I don't think you... What, lips and then sex? Yeah, you don't need the two and three in between. What, or what base three brains? might... But I think base three might come after base four. Do you get it? Yeah. Our brains after. Yeah, and then go slightly. Back to four, uh, yeah, four, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you get it? Oh, yeah. see, they're saying, yeah. I've, I've experienced. Yeah. Now yeah, yeah. The... You don't yeah, actually yeah. need three before four. <laughs> yeah. You don't need it before. You what about when you've been you like, married it and that? Like, it, does them bases even come into the factors? <laughs> 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 Because <laughs> obviously, like, Rah. as you are married for longer and longer, you want to try to introduce other <laughs> things for play. You know what I'm saying? Tracks. Receptionist. Yeah, it's a tracks. <laughs> but wait, but wait, huh? but wait, tracks. Smice it up, smice it up, man. You better go quiet now. Yeah, CJ. <laughs> All right, we're done. Uh, go on. <laughs> She's just going to watch this back. What? CJ. <laughs> Huh? CJ. <laughs> Tracks, what are you saying? Well, like, obviously, no, but there's boundaries, like, periods and... Oh, yeah, yeah. Saying. What? <laughs> what is it? Oh, what? What is it? <laughs> what do you mean, like? There's swings that you don't cross the line. CJ, a period to boundary. <laughs> I don't know what's going on here. I know, I know, I know, I know what Ron's saying. Yeah, obviously, you get it? yeah. Like, With the dress up thing though, I don't do like, all do that. You do, though. Like, do you have to start incorporating that into marriage? I don't, like, no, no. Some well, some people, yeah, I don't, no. No, I, it's not mm, a thing. Personally, I'm like, I don't think you need to. I get the fact that some people do switch it up, but let's see what hard oh, you do. Like, there's other ways you can do it. You don't <laughs> need to have. <laughs> you don't need to come back as you dress as a nurse. <laughs> I don't need that, bro. I so feel what like... So what do you want? You just go straight to... Vibes, music, vibes, music. With talk. wife, I'm saying 10 years. No, no, no. Wife... Oh, with wife. Oh, yeah, it's oh. it's always with wife, bro. So I you know what's going on. Like long term No, base, base one, base one. Base one, vibes, vibes, dance, 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 etc. Music, music, music. Cool, cool, cool. Then base four, maybe. You don't need to go... Um, you definitely don't need two, three... Oh, there is one more thing we've forgotten. And obviously, it's not for everyone. Some man... Obviously, like the what's it you um, uh, bocatting vibes. Do you know what I mean? Oh yeah. yeah. Obviously, why? No, that's base three still. That's base three. Oh yeah, you're that's right. That's along with the. Oh, brain. sorry, I thought we were talking about the other way. This is by the way. This is for the people after hours. I thought we were talking about the other yeah, way. Yeah, yeah. After hours. After hours. The other way. Huh? I uh, get you now. Yeah. yeah. Wait, for the that's people after important. hours. Yeah, I got yeah. a question for you, man. Yeah. Yeah. That's very important. Yeah. So listen, yeah. What is this? What would you what do you say about this, yeah? Say you are with a girl in, in bed, yeah? Say you're oh, single, okay, yeah? yeah? You're a girl in bed, Bro, yeah? Right, girl in bed, yeah, right. yeah, cool. You're single, yeah? yeah? And you're making love. Making you know, love. You got a bit of R. Kelly on. Why Candle, got R. Kelly, man? Candles flat. Cancel him, man. He's, got, he's done that here, bro. He's Candles on. He's done that here. And you're halfway through love making. Mm. Yeah. But the thing is, yeah, I say halfway through, she's just giving, sh giving shines, yeah? And then um, from the shine, she's like, you know what, she's getting all crazy, she's like anal. And then as you're doing that, a willy just flops down. Oh, yeah, between, yeah. between legs, yeah. <laughs> is it a, is it a, Stop I'm it. here already. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> I can't. Bro, no, or is it, question, or is it? At least four times. Three or four. But it's like get it cracking thing. Are you okay, it's bro? like get it cracking thing. <laughs> What? What? No, stop it, bro. No, nah, mate, we're stop swinging. It. No, stop nah, it. No, we're swinging, isn't it? it? Like, no, you want to pull out them things? No, Ron, stop it. Man, so you're getting cracking. No, nah, it's a fist thing. No. <laughs> Go away. <laughs> Go away. <laughs> Go away. No. <laughs> Swinging, we're getting... swinging, <laughs> naked, <laughs> naked swing. About to get cracking, what? <laughs> Make sure you subscribe to the podcast, okay, lads? If you are excited about the return of Anton forward slash, what are we doing? Are we putting I'm you on the tracksuit. intro as tracksuit? Tracksuit, I think I'm still tracking. I mean, I'm okay, tracky. tracksuit. Uh, the return of tracksuit. If you're happy, let us know. Yeah, send us your comments and questions. Agony uncles back in the building. All four of us going to be here Jeez. to help you with your relationships, situationships, and entanglements. We're going to love you and leave you for now, though. Much love. See you in the next one. For the people, tracksuit. <laughs>